myself Hidesh Shahre. I welcome you all. In this video, I am going to tell you about how to draw and remember the structure for benzodiazepine. So here, benzo means the benzene ring. Next, diazepine means presence of two nitrogen. Pine has two nitrogen present in seven membered ring. So this is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 4 benzo diazepine ring. Now this is a basic ring structure by which we can get these all structures all the So first of all diazepam. So here diazepam contain the methyl group, here the oxo group. At 5 position it contain phenyl ring. And in seven position it contains the chlorine. So this structure is for diazepam. Now from the diazepam we can prepare the nitrazepam structure. Now this name of the drug indicates the presence of nitra. That means here chlorine is replaced with the nitro group. And one more change that methyl group is replaced with the hydrogen. And it becomes the structure for nitrazepam. Now once we have the nitrazepam, again we can prepare this structure for clonazepam. So here it only contains here the presence of chlorine at the second position of phenyl ring, which is substituted at fifth position of 1,4 benzodiazepine. Now after the clonazepam, bromazepam is also we can prepare here. So it contains from the name bromine, presence of bromine. So here the bromine and one more change in this phenyl ring that change to the pyridine. So it is the structure for bromazepam. Now there are two more drugs, flu nitrazepam and flunazepam that we can prepare from the nitrazepam structure. So first of all come back to the structure for nitrazepam here. So as it contains nitro group. So here the nitrazepam, now we see flu nitrazepam. So it contains the fluorine, presence of fluorine atom that is to be at the second position of 5 phenyl substituted ring, fluorine. Secondly, here we can see the nitro that means presence of nitro group. And with this one more change, it contains the methyl group. It is the presence of methyl group. So it is a structure for flu nitrazepam. From the nitrazepam we have prepared. Similarly, we can prepare here the flunazepam. So here again indicate the presence of fluorine. So as it is, now it doesn't contain the nitra. So here it contains the fluorine atom as like the diazepam. And other change over here, one of the hydrogen is here replaced with the other substitution. Here the presence of Diethyl chain and it becomes the structure for flunazepam. Now, coming to the other series, oxazepam. So, before this, we are supposed to come back to the structure of diazepam. So, here we are going, this is the structure for diazepam. Now, we have to convert this into the oxazepam. So, here observe means presence of hydroxy group. That is substitute for so here at the third position. Now this is replaced with the hydrogen and become the structure for oxazepam. So there are two changes in the structure of diazepam. We have changes that replace, we have replaced this methyl group by the hydrogen and we have added over here the hydroxy group from the name of the oxazepam. Now once we have this oxazepam. We can convert this into the lower azepam. Let us see here. This drug only needs, as just remember, this here indicates the presence of chlorine. Again, chlorine. So here you have to add here second position chlorine atom. And it becomes the structure for lower azepam. Now from this, again we can prepare temazepam. Okay. So here, in this case, we can remember like this MET. Just go to the reverse side, M E T. That 
again indicate the presence of methyl groups. So here, come back to the structure of oxazepam. Now this is the structure of oxazepam. When you are to prepare it with the emazepam, this MET indicates the presence of methyl. So just substitute over here and you are getting the emazepam. Now the other thing is alprazolam. So here they will change. So as we are doing again the diazepam, the basic structure here. So it is supposed to replace this methyl with the diazole cysteine. So this is a triazole system, you can see there are three nitrogens, one, two and three. So it is a triazole system, it contains the methyl group, here, so this is what a alprazolam, this is a structure for alprazolam. Now from this alprazolam, we can prepare this triazolam. So it Word. This word will indicate here prior means azole is there as it is with the methyl group. So again in this case we have to add only one more chlorine atom at the second position and we are getting the structure for triazolam. Now the last structure that is the midazolam here it contains imidazole. Ring system here. Likewise this value converted to the imidazole. And lastly, this fluorine is replaced with the fluorine atom, and it becomes the structure for midazolam. So by one, we are getting another structure. So likewise, you can remember all the structure for the benzodiazepine. Hope you understood this all example. Thank you.